Tell me about, I know you had some role in, this, in the establishment of BioX. Yes, um, I, I did. How did you get I, involved? I, I, I actually made up that name, <laughs> which, came, which, came, which came from a conversation in Steve Chu's office. So he had in the office at that time some friends. Lucy Shapiro was there, and Jim Spudich was there, and I was there. And he was talking about biophysics. And I said to him, you know, there's, there's other bio, there's biochemistry that we could be bigger than that. And then we talked about other things like bioengineering. <laughs> and I said, why don't we call this thing bio X, where X could stand for the unknown. <laughs> <laughs> and we decided we liked that name, okay? So that, that, that welled up. Uh, and then he, and Steve led the charge in this, and he put this forward. And at that time, uh, a number of faculty thought this was interesting. This is actually a faculty origin program and brought this to the president, Gerhard Casper, who then brought it to the board of trustees and he said it was a great idea, but it had a horrible name. He says, we don't want nothing that's X-rated to be associated with Stanford. <laughs> <laughs> His legal background. <laughs> that was his legal background, correct. And I, I wasn't there, but, but the trustees said, you know, it's sort of cute. <laughs> they understood it. It's very scientific, where <laughs> X is an unknown, oh. a variable. Oh, that's right. <laughs> and so it, it, BioX, is, it, it stuck with it. And by the way, the, the reason it was named BioX was that it was biosciences, biomedicine, bioengineering, and, um, you know, the, the, the program in biosciences, biomedicine, bioengineering was clearly too long. And so uh, it was Dick Zare from chemistry, who was one of the folks working together with us, said, you know, this is bio X, it, it, it's bio everything. That's where the X comes from. Gerhard Kaspar said, this sounds like, this sounds like the name of a bad movie. <laughs> he said, you got to change the name. So we kept coming back at him with all these long names and they were, you know, they just, and so it ended up BioX just stuck. Then people from other schools and other departments became excited and they started coming to our group meetings. Uh, and then I remember one day when Steve Chu from physics, Richard Zaya from chemistry, Jim Spudich from biochemistry, and I, I remember, I think it was a Saturday morning, we're sitting in Steve Chu's office, I think then he was chair of physics, and we were all talking about our interdisciplinary science. And we said, we should have a single institute here that helps bring everybody together. What should we call it? And at that time, what was exciting was the program X-Files, and the X generation, and Richard Zare said, let's call it BioX. And we said, okay, let's do that. And then we went off to Gerhard Casper to try to pitch this, and we succeeded. 